The Idaho Food Bank was founded in Idaho in 1984 by a group of volunteers. Fast forward to today and we've got three facilities across the state and reaching over 200,000 people every single month. We didn't qualify for assistance from the state, but we had problems making ends meet and so um, it, it became kind of desperate and there was a point there where I was getting food from the dumpster behind the grocery store. Hunger is a hidden condition. And for many people, it's intentionally hidden. They don't want this to be visible to their friends and their neighbors. One in eight Idahoans are, are dealing with food insecurity. You can look across a group of eight people and you wouldn't see one of them that looks like they're hungry. We went from anywhere from $3,000 to $4,000 a month to less than $1,000 a month in about four months flat. And that's not enough to support a family of three. Without the donations um, and the great people who help distribute them, there'd be a lot of hungry people here. I'm really grateful that they spend their time that way. I'm really grateful that they don't judge me when I need their help. And I'm really, really grateful that my daughter doesn't have to go hungry. There's a greater appreciation for the importance and the, the critical aspect that food plays in people's lives for them to have good health. So we've really moved from that place of providing the food rescue to focusing more on making sure people are healthy. So from that hunger to health. I've been a cowboy all my life. And <laughs> the food bank supplements everything I've got. I'm 70 years old and my wife works part time. And so this supplements what we need. I don't use the food bank anymore. I haven't for many years. But I want to give back what the food bank gave to me when I needed it, the most when my children were young. We see those people in need who are so appreciative and feel good because somebody cares. And to be able to match those two things up is very gratifying.